I remember we had a discussion, right? Because during 2020, things went kind of um, haywire, right? Because, mm -hmm. you know, pandemic arrived and people were going crazy. And I remember the government came to you and asked you, can you uh, facilitate with creating hand sanitizers because you had a facility? Yeah. And they, they paid you. Uh, oh, um, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, they pay government. Oh, listen, U.S. government always pay good money. <laughs> But it wasn't just me. It, they came to all the distilleries mm -hmm. who are members of the American Distillers Institute. And they reached out. And they reached out and said, listen, we need every distillery that we possibly can to mm -hmm. get on and get involved. So I put my distillery name on mm -hmm. the list. And then they said, you know, stuff was coming. And they were like, can you handle this? I was like, okay. Mm -hmm. You know, but first it was, you know, giving it up. But then I was like, no, I'm going to charge for this shit because... <laughs> Yo, this is my liquor. You right, know what I right, mean? Right, I got right. complete denatured spirits because I was making, I was doing a um, denatured spirit for another company. Mm -hmm. you know, and denatured is when you have the spirit, but you got to put salt or something and you can't drink it, mm -hmm. you know, because they were using it for something else. So you always have ethanol. You always have ethanol or complete denatured spirit. Or mm -hmm. complete, you know, you always have it. Mm -hmm. So that's what's needed for the hand sanitizer. And all you really needed to get was, you know, went according to the WHO's formula, mm -hmm. you know, at the time. And that, you know, you got the hydrogen peroxide and you got the glycerin or the propylene. Guide. That stuff you can get and you can facilitate that right. because you have a facility. Mm. And I don't care what you say. If you don't have a distillery mm -hmm. and you not making ethanol, mm -hmm. you can't participate in that. Right, right, right. Okay, so me and a bunch of other, of course, a lot of distilleries. And for me, I did the hospitals. It was supposed to be you just take a territory, mm -hmm. you know, because they had all these dis distilleries in different territories. Mm -hmm. It didn't happen like that. Mm -hmm. Like once your name got on the list, everybody was coming at you. And it was yeah. like, okay, wait, 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 you know. Right. But, you know, I was glad to do my part. I made a lot for Department of Homeland Security. Big it came through. Big check. <laughs> Swipe, <they gave> <laughs> credit card. I was like, yo. <laughs> yes, I love Department of Homeland Security because mm -hmm. I ain't being deported no place. <laughs> Let me be real. But no, but, you know, ICE came through. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> so because they needed it in so many different places. Also, too, like to Kings County Hospitals. Mm -hmm. There's nurses, surgeons, schools. So then I started making... Um, a uh, 32 ounce gel, right. which was like 85%, you know, yeah. so that can kill anything, you know? So I was doing that and then started putting it in the tea bags. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was, I was like a, like I had a tea pouch. Right, right, right. Because we didn't have no bottles. Uh -huh. We didn't have any bottles. Mm -hmm. So I had these tea pouches like Capri Sun. Mm -hmm. Yo, you start filling those up. Ooh, filling them up. What? We were yeah. moving and people were buying it online. It was nice, mm. but it was a rush too. Like yeah, you yeah, make yeah. like money, like straight up money, like yeah. just hand over fist. Yeah. And you're just like, I could be here all night. Look, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I 